Menachem Klein joins us now from West Jerusalem. He's a professor of political science at Barlan University. Thanks very much for being with us. There's certainly a lot for Blinken to be dealing with on this particular visit. First of all, let's look at the defence minister's proposal for the day after the war on Gaza. What do you make of it? Uh, I see two, two strategies discussed yesterday in the cabinet, in the war cabinet. First, there was the security establishment attitude as presented by Yoav Gallant, Minister of Defense, which is Israel will stay in Gaza Strip in, in the different locations with different responsibilities uh, inside or along a pa perimeter uh, next to the, to the border with Israel. But Israel will take care on the security and supervise any other operation to rebuild Gaza Strip. Mm. Israel hopes that some, someone will take from Israel the responsibility, be it an international consortium or local families, clans, hamula, the, uh, different hamula on different areas. Do you think, this just to jump idea, in there, excuse me, do, 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 you think just to, do you think that's a likely scenario that someone else is going to come in and work with the Israelis to rebuild Gaza? No, no, no way. Nobody, no institution or state or organization will enter and put itself to be a target for Hamas fighters managing guerrilla mm. war against it. What should be done? Elections, general elections to legitimize the next administration without Hamas blessing and demilitarize Hamas, but Hamas, political Hamas, uh, let's say, okay, nothing can move. Israel is, Israel is unprepared to what it made in, in Gaza. The trouble is, though, we've already got the extreme right in Israel furious with this particular proposal. There's no way that they are going to accept the idea of general elections. Yeah, definitely. But also Netanyahu is against. And what I read from yesterday's exchange of blames and shouts in the, in the, cabinet, in the mini cabinet uh, meeting is that Netanyahu instructed his followers to attack the uh, Gallant and uh, the army and the chief of staff. Yeah, they made it under Netanyahu, re following Netanyahu request. The right wing, the extreme right wing, the Jewish supremacy parties, they want to clean Gaza Strip all out to expel maximum Palestinians to Egypt or they started talking about Congo and Latin America and then bring in settlers mm. and build new three city settlements in Gaza Strip. According to them, this is the, the uh, 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 let's say, amendment of the Israeli disengagement in 2005 and the implementation of their messianic redemption ideology. The, this is their view. Okay. Netanyahu... It, it... Isn't one of the problems here, yeah. Menachem, that the Palestinians need to come up with their own plan? And they haven't. Why haven't they? Because the, uh, Israel exposed Abu Mazen from all its authorities and legitimacy, and also Abu Mazen contributed to that. It's not only mm. because of Israel. Also, Abu Mazen made many mistakes and wrongs, but also the international community. Instead, the international community instead should have stated, this is the final status agreement. This is what we want to achieve. And we will, we will impose it on you or we will push very hard to achieve it. And we are involved. We, we don't leave you guys, fighting guys, to, to continue fighting. We want to, to see a settlement there. Without that, nothing will move. Israel must be, it, Israel's arm, arms must be switched by the international community. Okay. Menachem Klein, thanks very much for taking the time to join us there from West Jerusalem. We appreciate your insights and thoughts. Thank you.